All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushah, by Hashem Rakak Wadash. I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay? I want to do this spiritual review of the movie uh, Ready Player One. Okay? Which um, I watched it, I liked it. Okay, it got a 7 out of 10. Okay, um, I'm going to read the uh, movie info, okay, for anyone who uh, may, uh, you know, be interested, okay. But it just came out May 29th, and today is March the 31st, okay. So, um... I'm going to get into it, okay? Um, it says, in the year 2045, people can escape their harsh reality and the oasis. Um, which I think the word, word oasis means uh, um, my dwelling or dwelling place. Um, it says, uh, an immersive virtual world where you can go anywhere, do anything, be anyone the only limits are your own imagination. Oasis creator James Holliday left his immense fortune and control of the Oasis to the winner of a contest designed to find a worthy heir. When unlikely hero Wade Watts conquers the first challenge of the reality bending treasure hunt, he and his friends known as the high five are hurled into a fantastical universe of discovery and danger to save the oasis and their world okay now basically this movie is about video games okay and um you know basically virtual reality okay as i said a virtual reality okay so they will put on these uh virtual reality masks okay and they will go inside of uh of a world, okay, and they will put on they will have um these different um avatars, okay, that they can look like and do many different things, okay, inside of this um this world, okay. So um this um world that they were in was an escape, okay, from their harsh reality, okay. And um, basically, I'm going to um, pinpoint that and use that for today's world, okay? Because you have a lot of people who, um, they play video games and uh, they, they want to escape the harsh reality of this uh, world. And, um, you know, I speak from experience because, you know, you know, I still play the video game here or there, but, you know... To, to anyone who don't understand why this uh, world or this reality is harsh, you know, you're going to be caught up in, you know, in the video game and, you know, you got people that, you know, play video games and they, you know, s some of them are lazy, okay? Some of them, um, you know, uh, they just get caught up in, in the video game life okay, to escape the world, okay, for many different factors, okay, um, and, and, and I'm, I'll be the first to tell you that, hey, playing on video games can be, uh, addicting, okay, it's, it's addicting, okay, but, um, one of the reasons why they played on video games, okay, is, uh, for the nostalgic, uh, factor, okay, with the word nostalgia, okay it says the state of being homesick homesickness okay you might have a situation where you know and like i said i'm telling you this from experience okay somebody might be out okay doing without whatever and the whole time like you say let's say you go out on a um a date the whole time you you might be on a date there you know physically but your mind wants to be back at home, okay, playing that, that game, okay? And this was uh, the mindset that I used to have 
before I came in the truth, wanting to get, you know, get away just to go go back to play that, that game. Okay? And it says, um, another definition, a wistful or excessively sentimental yearning for return to or of some past period or irre irrecoverable uh, condition, okay? Something that evokes no no nostalgia, okay? So some of these people, you know, they 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 uh play these games, okay, to go back to a point in time where you know reality wasn't harsh, you know, this uh, imagination, okay, this imaginary realm, okay, that you basically put yourself in. And um, a lot of people in this movie, you know, they was doing that, you know, they was living in the port, you know, the slums and stuff like that, okay. Um, and he was, everybody was, you know, they had the whole world in this virtual reality game playing, you know. And, um, you know, a, a person who is into the nostalgic, because you got some people who like, you know, playing the old games, because that, that's how video games was when I was in the past, you know, or, or they may have think that those were the good times, you know. That's one of the things that people do when they um play these games or they go um they try to go back into a world where it just wasn't um it just wasn't hard or, or as harsh as it is. Okay, uh for example, um an escape. Okay, escape from the present day. Okay, and and, and truth be told, man, you have to deal with the present day. Okay, I'm gonna get the scriptures on that, okay? That's Ecclesiastes. 7 and 10. Say not thou, what is the cause that the former days were better than these? Okay, so, you know, you're not supposed to get in that, uh, the, you know, the, 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 especially here in America, you know. Oh, I remember back in the 1960s and 50s, and you know, you're not supposed to have that, that mindset that, you know, times was better back then. It says, for thou dost not inquire wisely concerning this. Okay. You're not um, thinking wisely when it comes down to um, the former days, okay? Because the Lord has something planned for his uh, servants, okay? That uh, is better than the former days and the present day, okay? <clears throat> Ephesians 5 and 16, it says, redeeming the time. Because the days are evil, okay? And, um, it's also in the, uh, book of, um, Ecclesiastes 7, I mean 3, okay? But I wanted to get the, the word, uh, redeem, redeem, okay? It says, to, to gain or regain possession of something in exchange for payment. Okay, so so buying back the time, okay, because we lost a lot of time in this in this uh, this this um society. Okay, we lost a lot of time in this um in this uh world that we that we living in right now. Okay, and this is uh, Ecclesiastes six and uh, three and six. A time to get, and this is the time that we in right now. Okay, we're in the time of getting ourselves uh, right, okay, for the kingdom, okay? Um, and, and, and in the kingdom, we're going to have the, uh, the, the, you know, whatever your, your imagination is, okay? You're going to be able to do that because, you know, they, was, they went through this reality uh, thing, you know, this reality game, I mean, uh, virtual reality game. In order to do these imagine imagination uh, uh, things, you know, that somebody else imagined or whatever their imagination um, was, you know, they went to this this uh, virtual reality and they uh, played out, you know, this fake um, life, okay? But in the kingdom, you know, we're going to be able to, to, to whatever you imagine, you're going to be able to, to do. You're going to have your spiritual powers if you're of the, of the elect. Okay, so so we're in that time of getting back the time. Okay, 
uh, because what does it say? The, 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 because the days are evil. Okay? We know that the, that rea reality right now is harsh. Okay? But we need to, to get back all that time that we done lost. Okay? Uh, feeling like, oh, we've we, we been homesick and um, we just want, you know, um, to get away or to escape. We're not in that time of uh, of trying to escape and stuff like that, escaping reality, okay? In the kingdom, it says, in a time to lose, okay? And that's one of the reasons why, one of the main reasons why people play the game, okay? Which is, you know, if you're doing, if you're doing the game on your, you know, as a, a leisure, there's nothing wrong with that, okay? I'm talking about the straight up, you know, sure enough addicts that, you know, just play the game and, you know, just escaping everything. And in the kingdom, you ain't going to be playing them games with that, you know, uh, depressed state of mind and trying to escape uh, things, okay? It says a time to keep and a time to, to cast away, okay? But the time to lose will, will be in the kingdom, you know? Right now, we're in that time of, of getting getting things right, man, getting our time, okay? And doing the most with our time, okay? Playing them video games can, can take up a whole lot of time. Okay, if you if you allow it to get get to you, okay. But we know that we gotta re, we gotta get this time and use this time wisely, okay. It says, "Wherefore be ye not unwise, but understanding what the will of the Lord is." Okay, so you know, getting in the spirit of doing them three videos a day, okay. Not playing three video games per day, okay. But getting in the the, the, the time of uh of you know doing what the the, the Lord wants first. Okay, because when 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 America shuts down, okay, they say the net neutrality, and they say that you gotta put pay, put my money into your um your your account to, to to play online or whatever. What you gonna do then, man? You know, the RFID chip comes out, and 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 in in order to play the games, you gotta have that chip. Then what you gonna do? Okay. See, the, the Lord ain't playing games with this society, man. You know, if you find yourself that you, you play the game all the time, hey, in, in the scriptures, there's a such thing as the Sabbath day. You take that, that time on the Sabbath day and you don't play the game. You, you, and, and, and that's what, what they did, you know, in the, in the end of the movie, okay? They, uh, the, the, the person that, that was found to be the heir, of everything, okay, this Wade Watts guy, he, he, uh, him and his team, they, they shut down this reality for, for, this virtual reality for, uh, two days, okay, so, so, it's a good thing if you, you know, um, take that time and just be like, well, I'm not gonna play the game today, okay, I'm gonna get into some scriptures, I'm gonna do, you know, link up with the brothers and so on and so forth, okay, it says, and be not drunk with wine, wherein is access, okay? So, so don't be getting in that all the time, always playing the game spirit, man. It says, but be, be filled with the spirit, okay? When you go out, be filled with that spirit, okay? It says, um, Philippians 3 and 13, going back into nostalgia, okay? Brethren, I count not myself to be apprehended, but this one thing I do, Forgetting those things which are behind, okay? The past, forgetting the past, man. Okay? Because you might have been, you might have, in this world, you might have been somebody. But then you ended up losing it all, and here you are, probably poor and everything, you know? Also, myself had that, that uh, happen to me, you know? Lost a lot of money for this truth, you know? Um... Uh, you know, I could have easily been like, you know, hey man, I, you know, I wish, you know, I, I, I remember when I had all that money, man, I could have been doing this, you know, and doing that, you know, but, but I understand that, you know, forget those things, cause the, the, the payment that's going to come from off of doing this truth is so far better than that money, so far better than that, that, that video game. I'm, I'm not using these video games as an escape. I'm hoping to escape this world, okay? When, when the missiles come, okay? It says, and reaching forth onto those things which are before, okay? And that's what we, we supposed to be reaching forth to, to the kingdom, okay? I press toward the mark 
for the prize, okay? So we supposed to set out that mark is the kingdom. Setting that setting our goal for getting to the kingdom. It says for the prize of the high calling of Yahweh, okay, and Yahweh Shah. Okay? So we supposed to be, be, be pressing towards the, the kingdom, okay? Because this 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 knowledge is a is a prize. Okay? Um this is uh Galatians 5 and 17 for the flesh. Lust against the spirit, okay, in, in this world, okay, there's a lot of things that's going to be uh, um, trying to battle us, okay, a lot of demons in this world, okay, and, and, and that video game, if you allow it, it could be a demon, okay, it could, it could be uh, something that, that uh, try to take you out this truth, okay, it, it, it won't put you in the right spirit, okay, and the spirit against the flesh, and these are contrary to the other one to the to the one, I mean the one to the other, so that you cannot do the things that you would. So when you're in the spirit and you throwing up these videos and you you um you you uh you know firing out these videos, these lessons and studying, you know that's in the spirit. Okay, dwelling around brothers, that's in the spirit in real life. But when you when you uh want to just you know. Always be playing the game, always uh, doing whatever you, you you probably doing, you know, to escape uh, reality. Some people probably go to the gym all the time, which sometimes you know that you can that 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 do uh, get playing going to the gym. You know that that's a good thing, you know. But but if you find yourself to be a gym rat, you. And you ain't into these scriptures. That's that's something that's going against the, the the spirit, okay. So with that man, you know that movie. You know I I think it was a good movie. You know just off the fact that you know I'm interested in video games and that's something that I do. You know, but in the spirit, man. You know, Lord willing, you know uh, I'm able to escape. You know. This uh this 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 kingdom when it's destroyed, okay. So with that man, Lord willing, this was edifying. I want to say shalom. Till next time.